two. So we are back with our design um, on purpose hour, the first hour. So the end of it, we just completed the journal for August and we were talking about the good, better, best goals and um, to how you can design this in your life and business, how you can get to the best in a natural way. Um, and we were specifically talking about money you know, and value and what you're, what you are inviting people to invest in you. So instead of the word charging, because that can feel gross, you know, and if we go into something feeling gross, then that's what we're going to get is we're going to get gross. But when you invite someone to make an investment with you, um, there's that invitation. And so if I'm invited to a party, I know that I can go or I can't go you know, or I'll know if I can switch around my schedule, you know, to be able to make it work so that I can attend or to make it work, you know, so that I can fill in the blank. And so, so in that, when we think about inviting people to invest with us, the good, better, and best, we could go to the best by saying, okay, this is where I will B. Oh, hi, Foxy. Um, so saying this is where I will be. And so how to get there. The good is the must do. The better is that doubled. And then the best is the better doubled. So what you can do is you can start off with the pricing of the best. Um, too many times people start low and then raise their price, raise their price, raise their price, raise their price. And then they feel guilty or bad about raising their price. First of all, you don't need an anniversary to raise your price. You don't need a special date to raise your price. You as a business owner can raise your price at any time that you want to. You can, um, you can do what you want when you want, you know, knowing, knowing, thank you, Kelly, for telling that, um, but we are holding the space for your son. Um, so anything that you type in the chats, we got you. Um, so, so in that, in raising your price, so knock out that there has to be a special occasion to raise your price. There doesn't. I know some businesses that are now um, making, you know, like $80,000 a month because they've known I'm adding more value. I'm going to raise my price. I'm adding more value. I'm raising my price. Um, I have, I know of someone that a friend of mine is coaching through and every quarter she raises her price. And so you get in grandfathered um, or yes, by Amy, um, or you're able to, you know, you move up with that. So it brings consistency and it brings um, that dedication that you know that you've been getting value. So you want to continue. Um, so talking about getting the best, earning the best, you can start off with the best pricing and then give a beta pricing to be able to, um, to be able to offer a savings to move to the best pricing. So that's what we were talking about in the mastermind is to be able to price what you're worth without feeling the guilt or shame in that. So you know your pricing instead of discounting your services and your pricing, you start off with that in mind. So um, yay, my celebration is the registration registration person let me sit with him before he went back oh that's awesome totally celebrating that with you is that a goofy on your mask yeah I love it that's awesome <laughs> so um so yeah so we were just finishing up the journal hour um and design in that super excited for this month it's it's so fun to be able to do all of them. Um, I'm going to take this off of recording. Um, 